Hey there all craft beer lovers, time for that beer review. So, returning once again to Stieg Bayer's Bruggeri out of Gothenburg, we're taking a look at their newly released, interesting beer I guess, Ringerbrau Rauchbier, coming in at 5% ABV in a 440ml can. Rauchbier, of course, smoked beer. Uh, kind of when we come to think about smoke beers or rauch beers, the German word, we come to think mostly of beers uh, like Erchlenkerla and so on. Uh, classical smoked beers, smoked is smoked malt uh, with different types of wood, uh, and that's it. That's what they're doing, and it provides the beer with a very, very peculiar, but in my view, a lovely taste. So, I guess Stay Bias has done this as well with this one. A little bit of a German-inspired uh, simple label, I, I would say. As I said, 5% there, 440. Contains water, malted barley, hops and yeast, unfiltered, unpasteurized. And that's it. There you go. Yeah. Alright, so with that said, let's pop that beer then and see what we have. There we go. There we go. Good little smoke. And immediately, this beer definitely looks the part. There we go. Just what I expected. There we go. Doesn't that look very, very pretty? I think it does. There we go. See if we can get the rest of that beer in. Yeah, perfect, perfect pour on that one. Okay, in view. So what do we have, guys? We have approximately three fingers worth of a uh, lightly brown colored head. Looks a bit compact at that. Definitely a dark mahogany colored beer. Look at that, looks very, very nice. Definitely got that smoked beer uh, look to it. Now let's go for the uh, aroma. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, smoked malts on the nose. Yeah, smoked wood, bacon. Like almost like smoked sausages on the nose. Combined with a lovely, lovely strong malt sensation. Concentrated smoked fruits. Like, like kind of dried apricots uh, put in over a, a warm fire, campfire. Bringing that smoke in, in its kind of dried meat. Yeah, that smells gorgeous absolutely gorgeous i have high hopes for this one so let's dive in see what we get cheers everybody oh yeah that's good that's a good smoked beer that's a good rauch beer mm. oh yeah full of character Got all those lovely things that you're looking for in a good, well-made Rauch beer. I would dare to say right off the bat that this is a little bit more... Uh, it's not so full-on as, for instance, the Erklenkerla Rauch beers. It's a little bit more uh, easy on the palate, but it's very well-made. Let's go for another one. Mm. Yeah, so it's definitely got a malty sweetness to it, combined with that lovely kind of meaty, bacony, smoked wood vibe. All those things combined. Yeah, lovely mix of sweetness, sweet malts, almost like a little bit uh, syrupy uh, in some instances. Uh, although the body of the beer is kind of mid-level, I would say, rather than thick and rich. But mid-level. Uh, very, very interesting beer. So definitely all, 
all those things that Stig Baguettes are doing, they, they most often succeed. One of my favorite brews for sure. They have definitely made a solid Rauch beer. So very interesting to see a Swedish uh, contribution to that genre or subtype of beers, if you uh, if you would prefer. Uh, it is a very very well made guy, well made beer. Uh, if you like uh, very intense smoky beers, a little bit almost kind of sweet smoked syrup, smoked wood, smoked bacon, dried apricots, smoked apricots. Uh, almost like a sausagey vibe you will definitely love this one for me it's a straight up four out of five lovely beer from staying by it thanks for watching